We're back on Studio 40 Live, and yes, I need a destination. I need a wellness, destination wellness uh, vacation. I need. Yes. That's what I need. I need to go somewhere and get well. <laughs> no one better to turn to than Libby Air Reynolds. How are you? Hi, guys. I'm so happy to be here. Where uh, where did you go recently? We just went to the Portola Hotel and Spa in Monterey to celebrate my 41st birthday. Hey! Hey, Woo! I just turned 41 on Monday, y'all. You're 30. No, 30 or 30. 31. 31. <laughs> always 31. No, 41, truly. But I, I challenged myself to run a half marathon in Monterey, and the Portola was a great place to stay. All right. To do the half marathon. Let's take a look! Oh my goodness, I feel like I am dreaming. You guys, we have just arrived at the Portola Hotel and Spa and I can tell you already, our stay has already been so exciting. It is my 41st birthday on Monday. I'll be running the half marathon in Monterey and this place is absolutely breathtaking. And the rooms are incredibly beautiful and clean. If you're looking for a place to stay, especially if you want to do the half marathon in Monterey, this Portola Hotel and Spa is amazing and beautiful. They have little doggy treats that give a Dodger a little bandana that he looks so cute in. I don't know if you've ever felt discouraged in, at any point of your journey in your life, but I know that I have been discouraged in mine. In my personal walk, my life changed when I was six years old and somebody took my innocence. I felt ashamed of myself. I felt ashamed of my life. And from that minute on, I didn't believe I was worthy of love and connection. I felt like I was dead. And one of the things that brought me back to life was Jesus and his love and hope for me his hope that I could be something different. And 10 years ago, I started my blog and I started my YouTube journey. And one of the ways that God started growing my confidence was through physical exercise, through me being able to finish a, a one mile run that maybe I didn't think that I could do. And then it progressed to two miles and then three miles. And then finally I said, you know, maybe I wanna try running a half marathon. I chose to run this half marathon in Monterey because I wanted to give God the time to heal me from the things that I've struggled with my entire life, feeling the trauma of what happened to me when I was six. Every year on my birthday is always debilitating and it feels like maybe I'm not going to make it. But what I love about God is that He restores everything and He wants to help us and heal us, but sometimes we have to give Him the time. It's hard sometimes to have time, so I dedicated my run to having God heal me. I said, Lord, you take the time to heal me like nothing else can. And every run that I've had, it's been an opportunity for me to just worship God. And it's been a very intentional season of training. And now that I get to run the half marathon this Sunday, I feel I could cry. I could cry right now telling you how free I feel, knowing that maybe we have gone through some really bad things, but God is going to do something good with it. And I really hope that this video inspires you to run your race, whatever that race is, to run it in a way that matters because you can go through whatever it is that you're going through, but you can rewrite the story. Look at wow. Libby Air preaching. I'm inspired. Aww. I am inspired. I Proud hope you girl. are. I'm Proud so yes. grateful, you guys. And oh, yeah. the things that made my my run really cool, Athleta sent me these beautiful little running kids. I ran in everything from Athleta, and it was awesome. Also seeing the signs Your kids of people. The signs. Uh, um, yeah, the signs that really fired me up were, you're not sweating, you're sparkling. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That kept you going? You're basically there. On a scale of 1 to 10, you're 13.1. And everyone. hey, where's everyone going? <laughs> If you guys want more information, I do have the vlog on my YouTube channel. Okay. So if you want to know more and know where everything is, all the nutrition that I used, all the things that I uh, um, uh, that I did at the Portola, uh, check out my YouTube channel so and great. subscribe. Good work, kids. Uh, nice job it. over nice there. Job. Good work, sign holders, videographers. They do and it all. Sign and sign makers. Libier.com is where you can find her. Check out that YouTube channel. She's got the vlog posted. Libier Reynolds does it again.